What is the maintenance to be carried out on OWS or oily water separate, separator? Essential servicing tasks to collecting plate, oil water separator as are follows. Check the water flow rate and visible condition of influent water. Test the operation of level switch and automatic pump switching. Remove the slides and oil from the water oil tank from the separator itself. How often shall you carry out the maintenance of OWS? Typically, service interval are between 3 and 6 months depending on the type of separator, the volume of water being processed and the amount of oil and sludge being removed. If you are still unsure, ask a specialist in oily water separators to help with your service and maintenance kitchen. Inspection and maintenance. Inspect floor drains, 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 sun interceptors and trap monthly and remove debris. Inspect the inside of OWS for sun, trash, sludge, and oily level monthly and perform maintenance in accordance with the OWS manufactured maintenance, maintenance guidelines. An oily water separator needs to be properly and regularly maintenance to stay in good working order. When these devices are not green and clean out re religiously, oils and other debris will stop them up and make them useless. This can cause the level, levels of oil in the released water to, be, to go beyond the influential limit indicated. Every engineer on the ship knows the importance of oily water separator, all which means is the OWS and must have heard stories of legal action taken against separators who tried to fiddle or bypass the automate, automation system of the OWS. The most common cause of the people tampering with oily water separator is the deterioration of the performance of the system. Apart from the filter getting clogged due to the continuous usage, there can be many other reasons for lack of performance. A few critical points which are often ignored and less commonly known to the engineers operating oily water separator on daily basis are discussed in this article to ensure the efficient performance of oily water separator, which is the coalescer filter type used in board sheet. Oily in builds, the separator is as suitable for separating a small quantity of oil in the builds and not the other way around. If, if there is a mixture consisting of a small quantity of water in oil, better not to pass it through the OWS and directly transfer it to mix oil tank or the sludge tank. And for the sludge disposal to shore or for the incineration. Uh, discharge outside separator never discharge or drain water oil mix from the separator abruptly out of OWS as it will lead to the separated oil I'll hear to coalescer making it the inoperated ensure to discharge the collected separated oil outside the separator in the clean and internal of the OWS by supplying water. There are some questions uh, I've ever heard. Uh, this one I have to uh, read this one. There sir, if the OWS is not working, malfunction, what action to be taken? How to handle when they have a PEC inspection? For me, uh, number one, uh, immediately inform the company. Number two, make an entry in the ORB about the malfunction of the OWS. And number three, collect bills in bill stock and record all the transfer details. Number four is when they have a PEC inspection, show all the records to PEC and the request sent to the company about the OWS. Okay, uh, when operating an oily water separator, can only be operated when the ship is sailing and in route according to the marfall. The oil contained of the influent must be less than 15 ppm or 15 parts per million and the ship has in operation an oily discharge monitoring and control system and oily water separating filtering equipment and the next one uh, 
in case of failure to follow any of the above mission rules, the ship will be fine and stop and the chief engineer or the second engineer can be even in prison man because of sub, such high risk operating and oily water separator shall be done with utmost precision to minimize the risk of marine pollution through a how to operate guide is always posted near the oily water separator there are few points to keep in mind and follow to prevent any mistake okay thank you very much for watching this vlog hopefully you have a uh, you have a small learning and i have to show uh giving you the OWS about the maintenance and operation thank you very much don't forget to follow and subscribe marine engineer works thank you